energy vibration um reading for the scorpion sun moon and rising sign i want to say thank you for being here thank you for being back thank you for the wonderful like shares and support please remember to listen to your sun moon and rising sign i want to say to each and every person this is going to be a week where from wednesday your energies is going to be feeling much better because then you're in your own zodiac energy vibration this is the fourth week of october the week begins from um the 22nd until the 28th um let's see what's coming out for you scorpions i'm doing close your eyes this week uh um and then we're going to be choosing the cards the zodiac energy of the week is the wheel of fortune so here we go it's not going to be placed um properly uh, because uh, I'm closing my eyes and doing this we um, um, angel we decide to do something different this week so we're closing our eyes to do this okay so the outcomes is the nine of swords some of you are going to be stop um, um, no more worries um, nine of swords um, you are no longer going to be worrying over whatever situation that was taking place some of you are going to be receiving message on Monday a hair sign Tuesday three of Pentacles someone in a legal situation is going to be working with you page of ones is coming in so there's a lot of message that is coming in um, we have energy of messages over um, information coming in to you and this information is from um, someone um, um, especially you men um, information men 45 years and over um, information will be coming to you about someone wants to partner up in business with you so on Monday you're getting um, some information documentation information some of you could be speaking out also Tuesday um, there is going to be a collaboration with others um, this collaboration is trying to make something work um, Thursday uh, Wednesday the energy change which positive news is coming in because um, Monday and Tuesday is the, the is carrying the energy vibration of uh, um, the Librans okay so the Librans end on the 23rd which is Tuesday on Wednesday good 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 news is coming in for you scorpions um, and to let you know that I end to a situation and a new start is about to come especially for the men 40 years and over um, 10 of swords you're going to feel stabbed in the back and art breaks so men um, the men um, age um, 45 years and older you are going to be feeling stabbed in the back and art breaks coming in for the men 45 years and older men 45 years and older for the rest of the people some news are going to be coming in about a new collaboration for work or an end to a negative situation that was happening in your life and a new start is about to come in for you scorpion so um, that is like beautiful for the rest of you but the men 45 years and older it can be men or women 45 years or older some a message um, you're gonna be um, feel stabbed in the back there's some negative things stabbed in the back and heartbreak so um, someone um, if you are 45 years and older you're going to be filled um, this energy coming up let's see what's coming up message page of swords the three of Pentacles and a page of swords some of you are receiving a message from the king of Pentacles whoever this person is some messages coming in so for you men 45 years and older the energy of the king of Pentacles is here he wants to work with you um, and um, whatever is happening or whatever is transpiring you are want to be collaborating with this person news 
um, the end of a cycle so this is good for um, you guys um, this is wonderful some of you are going to be meeting someone who is a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn they're going to be working together with you to end the situation and to have a new start and a new beginning um, with your financial stability okay so that is uh, really something twice the world so um, for a lot of you out there if you are between the ages of 15 and 45 it's going to be a very wonderful week let's look at the men 45 years and older what is coming out is a learning lesson so you Scorpio and men 45 years and older um, whatever transpire on Saturday or in the week it is a lesson okay some of you um, this is a lesson that you have to learn this person stab you there's a loss that is coming in uh, a loss a loss um, it could be in a relationship um, a heartbreak a loss the tower comes up for you guys also so um, whatever the worries was about the family there was some worries about the family the um, tower energy comes in about something that was deceptive um, with the family it's all about money and um, it can affect the men 45 years and older you this week is a learning experience okay news is going to be coming from for the men or women 45 years and older um, about a work collaboration with uh, um, someone that is uh, um, a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn okay whoever this person is I would not do it but yes it's up to you this person wants to work together with you um, to but he's gonna stab you in the back okay he's gonna stab you in the back whoever this person is is going to stab you in the back okay um, news is going to be coming in for some of you guys that is going to be bringing um, a new start in your life this new start be careful of this new start with this king of Pentacles because he's not coming in on um, very um, positive so again let me see what is happening for um, the people the scorpion it's your 45 years and older what is happening for the scorpion it's your 45 years and older um, just don't trust yeah scorpion it's your 45 years and older um, there's a situation with um, the knight of Pentacles don't trust him do not trust him if the knight of Pentacles is your partner in business don't trust him it's there's coming to an end to the situation uh, the energy of the tower is here let's see what is coming out with the ten of Pentacles for the scorpion it's your Sun moon and rising listen to your emotion listen to your emotion some of you are working um, together with someone it could be your father it could be someone at your work whoever this person is is not supposed to be trusted okay whatever is happening between you and this person it could be your father you're working together with this person but it's all about emotions you're pissed off you need to learn a lesson from this thing because it's your father and you try to work you, you you are not trying to heal a situation okay whatever the emotional imbalance is you're not trying to heal the situation you're trying to work against him or you're trying to work with him but it's not for the right reason okay he's gonna help you out of a situation whatever it is news is going to be coming in um, that um, and, and it's a situation that um, the, the news that is going to be coming in it's about someone stabbed you in the back but this is going to be over and a new start is going to be coming up for you guys there's a lot of discussion here finally you're going to be released out of a situation but um, you did it yourself um, what happened is that you guys have an energy offer uh, I I, I want to get back at someone it's not good don't get back on other people because it's going to affect you okay if it doesn't affect you it's going to affect your children if you don't have children it's coming back at you so you basically want to um, um, mess up 
either your father or your mother but as someone who is a Taurus or a Virgo but this person is hard this person is really hard whoever this person is they stand their ground they're really hard they try to work with you but they realize what you did and you're going to be receiving message that um, two people have stabbed you um, in the back okay two people have stabbed you in the back you're going to be receiving message about this um, you're trying to end an emotional situation some of you some of you are very very emotion emotional and this is going to come to an end okay some of you are extremely emotional whatever is going on around you you're just extremely emotion it's all about the money for you and you need to release yourself of this thing because this is all about the money for you guys and money is not everything you're losing a lot not knowing it okay um, the energy is some of you are going to be ending a relationship with your father or some of you are going to be ending a relationship with a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn man and he's coming up as your father um, you know you are going to be speaking to him hard you're gonna be ending this relationship or this business contract whatever it is at the tower is here and it needs to be end and clear out you have the energy of coming to the end um, it's as if some of you emotionally is drained you come to the end and you will just end everything around you in this week it is a karmatic lesson there it is the eight of Pentacles is a learning lesson and especially for the um, the people um, 45 years and older there's something that is coming to an end some of you could be um, receiving information that your marriage is about to end with a Pisces stars or a Capricorn that your wife your life your marriage is about to end some of you are going to be receiving message that if you're married to a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn your marriage is about to end some of you are dealing with a karmatic situation some good news are going to be coming in and as I said um, you know news positive messages but some of you are going to be realized that someone um, stabbed you in the back whatever you have done it's going to be turning back on you because um, you did something to someone and the, the wheel of karma and the wheel of fortune is not fortune but it's bringing karma back to you something you have done to someone in the past that is bringing karma back to you you are at um, you you have come to the edge and this means that you feel as if you're alone in this world as if nobody cares about you no one wants to be there for you and the people who cares about you and want to be there for you you push them away by being very destructive in your behavior and this is what is happening to you but there's always one thing your parents love you no matter what no matter what your parents love you they're there for you and they're not going to let you down okay all right so I want to say thank you for being here thank you for being back namaste until next time